everybody welcome to my channel pretty over here to read your messages for the emergency room what in your energy needs to be addressed immediately what cannot wait a lot of the times we have spiritual issues that manifest themselves on the 3d as mental and physical issues i'm here to bridge that gap with this reading throughout the video i will be making um suggestions on how you could attack these issues head on if you have any suggestions and you are going through any of this and you and you know any something that helped you please put it in the comments because we all learn from each other here um i have reversible soap i don't know if you guys can see this but i've been showing everybody look at it it's black and red it's beautiful it's to reverse negative conditions i only have one left okay the 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 love soap and the cinnamon soap as well one one of each of those left as well so you guys go ahead and check that out love and attraction soap it speaks for itself and then you have the cinnamon soap which deals with luck and prosperity i am recommending my seven plants bath to everybody this month okay mix this with some milk and get a, a vibration of richness and prosperity on onto your aura okay we all been going through a lot during this time <laughs> okay so i feel like that's going to help everyone i will be taking it too okay i use all of my products <clears throat> all right so you guys some of you guys are going through something it's, it, it's challenging all right I, I really feel like you guys got some pent-up aggression in you and i think something is going on with mars it's uh, you know, it's in Aries and then it's like fight, fight, fight. And then everybody just wants to fight. And you feel like, what's up, right? You're tired of it. You're tired. What do you want from me type energy? Like, you know what I mean? Um, There's somebody whose name is Angela or Angel, okay? And, 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 and either this person passed away or your name is Angel or Angela. But either way, it's like they are really... um, You know, and this is angelic in energy. And so that may be that Angel, Angela... Uh, it was what I'm hearing, right? Because you are being called spiritually to move. There's somebody that really feels like they're in a sunken place, really, really depressed and, and you know, tired of what they're going through. And this has to do with a tower moment that may have happened with something or someone that you're passionate about, okay? Could be a reference to a Gemini is what I'm seeing. A Leo or a Sag as well, all right? Um, you're being called to reach out to spirit, reach out, reach out, and then, you know, await your results. Don't get upset, right? And then, you know, fall into this place where you forget to pray or you forget to connect with the divine. Okay. This is what I'm getting. Somebody needs to take a bath in camphor. I'm getting, I got that for everybody, you know, because camphor is very cleansing. It's repelling of negative energies. Camphor is very, very energy. It gives you energy and it cleanses your, your, your aura. Okay, because you're feeling helpless and hopeless. A lot of you guys need to work out and meditate, okay? Um, because I I feel like all is really well, you know, I, I do. I really do feel like all is well, but you might be harping on something that you're going through or something that happened in the past or something like that, you know, and I'm getting the energy of believe and succeed. The, the angels and your ancestors, they're pushing you, all right? Somebody needs to take up kickboxing or karate or something, because... Before you put your hands on somebody's like, what right? I feel like mm, right? I feel like that's what y'all want to do. Okay? It's like, it's like, mm, mm, right? And then with the awaiting results, and it's like, now what? Right? Don't do that. Don't do that. I don't condone violence, okay? I do not. Especially not publicly. <laughs> okay? I don't. So you guys are mentally, you know, you're trying to heal, but you just keep, it's like, I feel like you're reaching a roadblock. Like, you know, you're just seeking, seeking patience and solace. Reach out to Jesus, okay? Jesus is very, very good with patience. You see what I'm saying? Because here comes, goes this energy of discontentment. It may be something that you were passionate about and, and, and you know, you missed it, right? It was a missed opportunity maybe to, to, to grow or to you thought that you could be with this person or have this whatever, but it wasn't. It didn't work out like that. So it left you in a vibration of feeling hopeless, you guys. <clears throat> yeah, with the Ten of Cups in reverse, whatever this is, it could have been a family situation. And it just makes you sad, all right? And you're, looking, you're trying to heal from that. Look at that. You're asking why, okay? Why? Why me? Why this? And, and, and you know what? I really feel I get, I'm getting the energy of whatever this was. It wasn't for you, all right? It wasn't for you. Some of y'all, you feel like time is running out. Look at that. Time to go. <laughs> okay? Right on time. Spirit is confirming 
Whatever it was, it was like somebody walked away from you or you walked away from somebody because you... Look at that. Time is of the essence, okay? I wouldn't tell you wrong, all right? Spirit is confirmed. Okay, you guys, and this is, this is, this is just how you're feeling. Read some books, you guys. Somebody needs to particularly look up what I'm hearing. Somebody needs to look up what a narcissist is. Somebody needs to look up narcissism. I feel like you may have been dealing with one. All right. Surrender to the wisdom of your body. Listen to your body's messages about a person or situation. If you feel physically drained or uncomfortable, be cautious. If you are energized and happy, move forward. You know why, okay? You know why, right? Can you handle the truth? This person wasn't for you. This thing wasn't for you, all right? This person, I really feel a heavy um, emphasis on a narcissist. <laughs> this is a vampire you're dealing with too look at that surrender to spirit and surrender to joy is what wanted to pop out and this is what i was saying don't 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 feel like you can't pray or you can't you know all right i feel like this took a toll on you spiritually but once you've done everything you can to achieve a goal turn the situation over to the, the divine and let spirit work is magic for you um you guys somebody thinking about swimming in the lady pond and and their lady <laughs> all right have fun okay surrender to joy it's like go ahead look at our legs they're wide open <laughs> All right, y'all. Excuse me. Um, <clears throat> okay. So in the spiritual position, you guys, you're being called to move. Don't sit there, right? Don't sit there. Somebody having problems with their mom in particular. They miss their mom. Someone misses their mom. All right? If you have a goal or dream, uh, you know, please manifest it, you guys. If it has to do with some type of prosperity, get a candle right do an open roads uh you know ask ask the universe or whoever it is that you pray to to open up your roads okay please believe and you will succeed is what i'm is what i'm getting another thing too um somebody may be trying to show up in you guys' dreams or something like that and they want you to reach out to them okay and they're waiting for you to call don't because i feel like it's that narcissist don't as a matter of fact burn, burn black candles around you all right Especially in your room near your bed. It's like, I don't need to think about you. Whoever this narcissist is, like they're trying to stay on your mind. So it's about matters of the heart. Somebody missed their mother that passed away. Okay? She's there. A unicorn may be of significance. Somebody's mother may have died in some type of childbirth. Or I see rape here too. I don't like it. I don't know, Taurus, let me just say this. I don't know why every time I do your readings, it's somebody out there, okay? It, it, it's rape, it's molestation, it, it, and, and it makes you sad, and I'm sorry, okay? I feel like I want to cry. I'm sorry that that happened to you or your child. Sorry. Woo. It's every time. And it's the Taurus Collective. I keep picking it up. You have exchanging gifts. Yeah, I feel like the universe wants to give you what you want. No place like home. But you're still thinking about the past, right? You're still thinking about the past. And, you know, it is also that energy of, yeah, and this could be astral rape. This could be somebody raping you on the astral, right, for your energy. That's another thing, too. Wear amethyst and also black crystals grounding yourself. Take a bath in that camphor, right? Barricade your room with protective energy wherever you sleep. Your cat tries to protect you. Yeah, exchanging gifts, milk and honey with blessed at the bottom. Like I said, I feel like all is really well, Taurus. I really do. But it's just where your mind is taking you, okay? Stay focused. Stay focused. 
I heard you got it, girl. You got it. <laughs> Look at that. Surrender your comparisons with other people. Keep your eyes trained on yourself. Focus on your own strengths, attractiveness, and power. Tiger's Eye and Carnelian is going to help you with that. You got it, girl. You got it. Don't worry about... um. Don't worry about what's going on with anybody else, okay? Keep your eyes on your own paper. Surrender to effortlessness. Stop pushing so hard. The art of living means going with the flow instead of trying to force the river. That's what I'm saying. You got it, girl. Surrender to trust. Trust yourself in your decisions. Don't be swayed by other people's strong opinions about what to do. Take action and be confident that you have chosen the right path. You got it, girl. Surrender to divine timing, okay? You're fine. You feel, and you know, with this challenging times, it's like it takes me back to the past. It's giving me past energy. And you're in the energy of wanting to fight, I really feel. Let me get one more from here, I feel. So, yeah, you're about rebuilding. You're trying to rebuild your life, you know? And I feel like everything is okay. It's going to be fine. There's, there's, there's an angelic presence, like, literally. Somebody may have felt, um, somebody may have felt a literal hand on their back, Okay. Yeah, you're trying to master your emotions before you... <laughs> I've been moving calm, don't start no trouble with me. But I don't think... I, I don't... I think you guys are fine, okay? Trying to... Trying to keep it peaceful is a struggle for me. <laughs> yeah, you guys are like about to be... You feel like you're in a rage sometimes, right? And it's all in reference to the past. It is, I really feel, okay? You're fine. You're fine. going on physically physically you guys may be feeling some anxiety um gas fork in a road okay fork in a road you guys may be going for drives flexible do yoga you guys you do yoga some people trying to figure out shit look at that not for you should they still talk to their family or what or should they still keep this person around or what right should i mend this situation I don't think so. I think it's not for you. I don't think it's for you, okay? Do like I said, do that. Do oh, I, I didn't tell you guys. Um, I've been recommended to everybody, it seems like the egg cleansing, okay? Focus on your heart chakra when you do uh, you get an egg and you rub it all over your body, right? In the in I mean energetically, okay? So the egg is still, you know, right when you get it out the cart and it's still like this, and you're rubbing it. What eggs do is they um they pull in it's gonna pull all that negative energy right so it's called olympia l-i-m-p-i-a okay focus on your your chest your heart center okay right here right because i feel like whatever's hurting you is in your heart center okay crack it and throw it in the toilet light a white candle while you're doing this and talk to your angels your ancestors and your spirit guides and say i give this to you god or whoever it is right that's your higher power. I give this to you. Crack it and flush it down the toilet. Don't worry about it again, okay? Because you got it. Surrender resentments. Holding on to resentments only poisons you. Try to forgive others for their shortcomings and keep moving forward toward positive situations in your life. Somebody hurt y'all, okay? Somebody hurt you guys, and that's okay because you're moving forward and you're about to receive blessings. Don't worry about it. Surrender procrastination. You guys need the exercises coming up again. Now is the time to jump on a goal instead of putting it off. Taking action will attract success, okay? You guys can use my seven plants bath, like I said, mixed with some milk. Because you guys have the energy of spirit in the universe and your angels and your ancestors and your spirit guys backing you up. So take advantage of it. I hope that helped you guys. 